So a friend of mine, uh, hey, welcome to the Sam Podcast. So a friend of mine emails me the other day and he goes, dude, you got to do this. And he outlines this recipe and I go, well, I'm freaking crazy, man. He goes, no, no, trust me, it's good. Just got to make one, one adjustment here. So here's how it starts. It starts with ramen noodles, like packaged. All right, all right. And of course, there's going to be boiling water in a second. Bit. Oh, how embarrassing. Ramen noodles like this. Well, now I'm at a quandary because this is a double package. So he goes, you just take a pack of noodles. And of, of course, I had to buy fancy ones that have two things here. The seasoning pack that goes in. Oh my gosh. Why couldn't this be easy? And you know what flavor this is? Hmm. Uh, ugh. Spicy, I don't know. Spicy something. I don't know what this vegetable mix. So what the hell was that thing that I just put in? The seasoning, I'm sure. Soup base. Let's put yeah. them both in, okay? Yeah. We'll put them both in, right? So now you just cover this, he said, with boiling water. Just cover. Now I'm a little unclear as to this next part. So look, cover with boiling water. He said, just cover. That looks like that, right? That's just covered, correct? Yep. There was no draining or straining or anything. Now you leave this for a couple minutes, okay? Okay. Uh, while that's uh, doing its thing, now we beat some eggs. One, two, he said three eggs. Who might argue with? Yeah. We can do this. One, two, three. Nice. Shell. Shit. I didn't have to say. That's embarrassing. It's not embarrassing. It is pretty good. Shell. There's still more shell? Yeah. Fuck. Damn it. Beat the eggs. Now, because there's. There's this soup base in here. We don't need to add any seasoning. Yeah, salty enough. Salty enough, right? I don't know about the noodles though. I mean about the, the liquid. Let me tell you what happens here and then you can help me understand if I need to. If I need to drain it. I think I need to drain it. What are you supposed to do? Just put the egg in? So here's the deal. Now we take this. No, the hot liquid is what's going to cook the egg. No, I understand. Huh? The hot liquid. No, 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 no. This goes on the stove top. Oh. Oh, are you making like a stir fry type? Yeah. Uh, Forbes, if you're uh, watching, you didn't tell me this part. There's, there's clearly, there's too much liquid here to go yeah. into this. I think you're just cooking the noodles and then you're stir frying them without the liquid. No, 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 no. Yes, I think you're right. Yeah. So we just let these soften, right? No, 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 yes. Let me just taste these noodles. Whoa, spicy. That's spicy. Put in a good way. Let me get a strainer. We're basically making like a ramen frittata. Little oil and a little 
Ah. Little Montekia. My broiler is on. Even. Oh, we're putting this in the broiler. Huh? Well, yeah, we're setting on the top stove top. Okay, I'm gonna go for it. You ready? Ready. So this is what's gonna happen. Forbes failed to talk about that part, but we're gonna do this. Okay, go over there. Ready? Ready. Make sure there's enough coverage here. Noodles go in. Oh, maybe this needed four eggs. Oh no, this should be fine. <laughs> wow. Late night Japanese stoner food. If I could call this anything, yeah, am I this right? This is awesome. Back up for a sec. Wow, shit, I feel like I could have put another egg in here. I'm going to. You stay where you are. Oh, this doesn't F it up. I don't think you need it. You don't think I need it? You got good coverage. I don't know that I got good coverage. Let me do it. Like you're gonna mess it up. I'm not gonna mess it up. The dude didn't tell me anything about the uh about the draining, which honestly I think he should have. So could he have been wrong about three eggs instead of just so versus four? Yes, I think he could have. Fine, we're okay. We're okay, Max. We're okay, we're okay. Just let it set on the bottom a little bit. Oh, shit, I'm all over this, man. You know what this needs when it comes out? Fucking green onions up the yin yang. So you want to make sure that it's loose, right? That the, the bottom is not attached. You don't want it to stick. No salt, no pepper, no seasoning. It comes with it. So far, we're at two ingredients. Do you count boiling water as an ingredient? No. Two. Well, dude might be onto something other than not telling me about the draining. And now it goes under the broiler. Shall we? Let's do it. Wow. I don't know. Three, four, five minutes? Okay. I'll start checking at three and then see what happens. And then, and then we eat. And here we go. Ready? Yes. Remember how it went in? Noodly, starting to set on the bottom a little bit. And now? Oh, wow. Look at. Whoa! Ramen mania. Yes. Am I right? Hold that on now. Awesome. That's awesome now. That's what it needed. And here we go. That's not right. Wait. Yeah. It's Japanese. I should have sticks. Should I cut myself a little wedge? Yeah. Look at that. I can. I just got back from Japan, and I can totally see this being served at a cool Japanese restaurant. <laughs> it's crazy. Wow, I'm loving this, man.
I'll tell you what makes this is the spice from the, uh, the that ramen itself. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Rock out. But the it needs just a little moisture, and I'm gonna let this uh, little sambal do it. Like that. Now we're talking. Mm. Ridiculous late night food. I would put ham in that. Like, like little bits of ham in the pan first. Shit, I think I have a new addiction. Mm -hmm. Yes, I love green onions. But oh my god. This ramen frittata. Could be my new thing. And by the way, you have to drain the noodles. If you didn't drain the noodles, this would have been a huge mess. Yeah. I think a huge mess. All right, that's it. Thanks for hanging out. Make this. Make everything. Not the same thing all the time. Clearly, this is not the same thing all the time.